Hello everybody, and in this two-part series, we're going to be creating a potion in a game where there's a potion that you can drink, and it will give you a health bonus or a speed boost. Uh, pretty much, we're just gonna, I'm just going to show you how to make a potion, and then you can choose whatever you want it to do. So, we're just going to make this from scratch. You can make this, of course, in any world you want to make it in. But, I'm just making this from scratch. So, in order to create the potion, the first thing we need is a model for the potion. So, we're going to insert in a sphere. Except if a potion were... So, we're going to make... Pretty much, we're going to make like a bottle sort of thing. Except if the base of the potion were to be this big, that would be a gigantic potion. So, we're going to make it high, much smaller. So, we can use the transform tool. And it's being a bit weird, but... Okay. So, I'm going to set it so that these are... Maybe... Yeah, I'll do... 1.5 big. That's how big I'll make the sphere. So, once you've created that... You can, like, color it. Whatever color you want it to be. So... I'm gonna make it, I don't know, blue, I guess. Actually, I'll make it a bit green. And then, you wanna make a, well, like, a sort of nozzle kind of thing. The top of the potion. So you can, of course, make these things look however you want them to look. It doesn't change how the script's gonna work. But... You guys just like don't make it look terrible, I guess. They'll probably make people like your game more. And anyways, we color this. Eh. So again, you can put way more effort into your potions than this. Um, again, this stuff doesn't matter. So it's kind. So yeah, you can put way more effort and make it look much better. And. Yeah, the next thing that you're going to want to do is union it, or, I'm sorry, no, we're wrong. Actually, yeah, union it. And then rename it to handle. So rename it to handle. And then go into workspace and also insert in a folder. Or no, sorry. A tool. Yeah, a tool. And then put handle into the tool. And rename the tool something like potion. And then you just got to take that and put it into the starter pack. So now we can hit the play button. And then we'll have a potion. Again... You can put much more effort into this. Um, you can do things such as make the tip of the potion this by making some invisible block right here. That way the center of the potion would be here. That way a player is gripping it right there. Or you can make it grip at whatever point. If you know what I mean. But, and then if this doesn't look good, you can change it. If it's sideways, you can make it the right side up. Make sure this is not anchored. That's one of the important things. And you can see how this is called potion because in in the starter pack, we named it potion. Make sure that it's named handle. It has to be called handle, though. And then, yeah, there you go. That's how you make a holdable tool inside of Roblox. Next part, in part two, we're going to be making this actually a working potion. So... See you at part two.